eggs, please, ma'am. Jimbo, who's the new guy? Wolf. He's in the Marshalls in Louisville. Oh. Company sent him in to help out. Well, Mr. Wolf, if any of these badasses give you a hard time, just take away their bladder medication. <laughs> I used to like you. As long as they do what I say, we got no problem. Wolf still thinks the Western District's the place to be. Where's the Derby held at? Is it in Lexington? No, that's right, it's in Louisville. Where's UK? Is that in Louisville? No, it's right here. You got color TV here yet in Lexington? Oh, uh, that's next on the list, right after indoor plumbing. I believe it. Traveling light today, Miss Hawkins. What? Where's the other bag? Oh, I left it here overnight. I could swear I saw you take it. Well, last don't time. swear an oath, because I didn't. Good morning, Raven. Hello. Mm -hmm. Oh, Miss Hawkins. Good morning, Judge. Good. It blows dead donkey dick. Look, with all the crazies outside, I need to get this ruling done by lunch, and I want to put the fear of God into counsel before I do. Let's go. Okay, I just need to put my bag no in my time. office. It'll only take one minute. What's so important in there? You have to put it in your office right now. Gym clothes? <laughs> Shit. I know 50 men in this building that pay good money to sniff your gym clothes. Well, I will keep that in mind if I'm ever short on cash. You can take it upstairs later. Let's go. Well, there you are. Yes, here I am. Judge Reardon wants to see you in chambers. Well, me, why? I'll bet that comes up in conversation when you see him in chambers. It's inflammatory and meaningless. Ah. It's the truth. Mm -hmm. Captured on DVD. Yeah. Illegally obtained. They thought they were on Just state quiet. land. Quiet. Come here, debate the damn thing. I heard you both on this ad freaking nauseam. We're here to lay out the ground rules of behavior in my courtroom, and I'm warning you. Anyone, either side, gets out of line, I will clamp down on you like a bear trap on chicken legs. Judge. What? Well, look at here who it is, Raylan Givens. Your Honor? Yep. Everybody, this is Deputy U.S. Marshal Raylan Givens. Saved my sorry ass not so long ago from a man intent on killing me. He's two of the counsel on the Fly Rock case. I know you know this fine young lady. Deputy Givens and Miss Hawkins here were married in a previous life. How'd you ever let her get away? We all make mistakes. Yeah. You asked for me? Oh, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> court security honcho said his team checked my courtroom, but his team's a bunch of geezers. They're all retired marshals. And they're all well past their sell-by date. I'd appreciate it if you'd give it a look-see. No, no. Tensions are running high here, Deputy, and uh, I don't know if I bring my gavel down I don't set off some kind of incendiary device, hurry us all along to our maker. <laughs> you do that for me? Do it right now. I appreciate it. So, you telling me that you found yourself someone better than that? Um, Boyd? Hello, Raylan. What are you doing here? Oh, they were gonna put us on a bench out there in the hallway, but then the plaintiff's family's there too, so everyone thought we'd be better off in here. I hope we're not in your way. Raylan, this is Miss Carol Johnson. She works for Black Pike, the defendant in the federal civil case before the court this morning. Miss Johnson, this is Deputy U.S. Marshal Raylan Givens. It's a pleasure. And likewise. Forgive me if I was rude. I've been asked to um, make sure the courthouse is secure. So again, Boyd, what are you doing here? Boyd is part of my security team. Security? I like the suit. You're aware that Marshal Service provides courthouse security in any federal case? <laughs> 